Welcome back to everyone in Countdown to Kickoff. I'm Steve Lehman. And I'm Vicki Yates at the brand new Geodis Park. And Steve, I know you're a sports guy, but not everybody comes to sports facilities for the sports. They don't? No, they don't. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I know some people love the atmosphere, That's and of right. course, you can't forget the food. And this place has you covered, and so does our Alexandra Cohen. Ready to roll? At Daddy's Dogs, they put a spin on ballpark hot dogs. Make sure we got some good char marks on that dog. But this specialty dog is sweet, spicy. Those nice and gold peaches. And savory. The bacon on top. It was created specifically for Giada's Park. And there she is, the Nashville SC. On tour, Sean Porter was known as Big Daddy. He even has this tattoo. The king of hot dogs. It's just a self-portrait of me and a hot dog. All right, so it's Chicago, no mustard, add secret sauce and a Sprite. Yeah. We started this out of my garage as kind of just a side hustle and it quickly turned into something more than that. He's pumped to serve dogs to soccer fans. Let's hope the boys take home the cup this year. If hot dogs aren't your thing, don't worry. Nashville's favorite hot chicken will also be offered at the park. Then you have my mother who took over in 1980. Simone and Jeffries is honored that Prince's hot chicken will be inside its first stadium. I've never done concessions, but this is gonna be your first, but it's gonna be cranking it out and getting it out much, much faster. How are y'all doing? Her great uncle Thornton Prince is the main reason Nashville is the hot chicken capital. He was out too late one night and she decided to get him back, but it's called that feel good hurt, um, where you know something burns, but and she created a dish for him. Turns out he loved the hot spicy chicken. So she had to recreate his punishment. It turned into a business, one that's still booming. I think this is a little way of us expanding the brand and um, opening up other doors for us and giving us other opportunities for people to enjoy what we've loved to do for so long. Reporting in Nashville, Alexander Cohen, News Channel 5.